In San Luis Obispo County, the Board of Supervisors voted on an important step to help move forward in the governor's resilience roadmap. News Channel reporter Dave Alley was there and spoke with leaders who are feeling confident about after today's meeting. And Chairperson Compton. Yes. Very good. This is a happy day for a lot of people, I think. So. San Luis Obispo County Supervisors give an emphatic thumbs up to reopening, voting unanimously to once again ask the state to open up more businesses. I feel good about it and I, I'm happy we're moving forward. Board approval gives County Public Health Officer Dr. Penny Borenstein the green light to file a new attestation with the state. It allows us specifically to open restaurants to um, in-house dining and retail businesses for in-store shopping. An earlier request was never approved, likely since the county failed to meet one requirement. But Governor Newsom announced revised criteria Monday. The county um, now qualifies on all the metrics that the state has asked for, and we have every expectation that we'll be able to move forward. Reopening has been a county goal for weeks. We're looking at up to a $57 million budget shortfall. We're looking at 30% of our San Luis Obispo population being unemployed. So we really need to get going uh, again. Which leaders say will be done safely. We're in a really good place in this county. We have measures set up in case we see a spike in cases. We will move back and we will pull back a little bit. Dr. Bornstein will submit the attestation today on Tuesday. No time frame when the state might deliver back an answer, but the county believes it will be very soon and is hoping it's as early as this week. I am going to be actually bugging them on a daily basis. We but, know that businesses can't wait another day to reopen. But soon that wait might be over. In San Luis Obispo, iNews Channel reporter Dave Alley.